So I was just chilling, you know, minding my own business when I thought, hmm, you know what I forgot about? That one time Minnie Lad groomed a couple minors. <laughs> So I was like, damn, you know, I, I kind of want to I kind of want to see how long ago that was. So I looked up his channel, expecting the last video he posted to be, well, you know, when the shit happened. So I clicked on his channel and to my surprise, the last post was 10 days ago. This guy is still making content. Like, bro, why is this shit allowed? Like, bro, didn't EDP get, like, actually banned? Which, I mean, I guess makes sense, okay? He did actually attempt to meet up with a minor. But still, man, Minilad like, had, like, completely undeniable proof that he did this shit. And YouTube is still paying the man? Like, bro, why is he still getting a paycheck from the platform that literally introduced him to the minors? That shit is wild. Now, granted, he's not pulling anywhere near the amount of views that he used to get. Like, I mean, he used to pull, like, 5 to 6 million views. But now his, I mean, his most recent one is still at 35k. And bro is, I know that's low, but bro is still getting paid for those 35k. And not to mention the fact that he acts like nothing fucking happened in his newest videos. Like, look at this shit. His newest one is just him streaming a try not to laugh, where he screenshots every time he sees a bird. Not even kidding. Like, that's it. That's the content. He's screenshotting birds. I mean, like, wow. What a fucking genius, really. I, why didn't I think of that? Here I am writing writing a script about a pedo when I, when I could have just been laughing at bullshit and screenshotting birds. You know what? That's it. Next one. <laughs> I'm screenshotting birds. I'm fuck I'm doing it. Listen, I never watched Mini Lad before all the like pedo shit went down. But like, was he always this fucking retarded? Hey yeah. I mean, really, bro's bro's acting like a fucking animated character, and, and it's so weird too because this guy's watching memes, but his reaction to each meme is like the exact reaction you'd expect someone to have. If that makes sense, like the dude's the dude is actually a fucking AI. The way he's reacting to this shit reminds me of those like TikTok live stream retards that act out each donation. Fire, fire, meow, hee ha, yes, you got me feeling like a cowgirl. Let me write it, huh? Oh, thank you, fruity. I love you. Balloon. That's him. That, that's this guy. That's what he does now. First it was grooming minors and now it's this shit. Listen, I'm watching this video and like, I just do not fucking like this guy. Which, I mean, that's allowed. Okay, I'm allowed to not like him. He is a pedo. But like, y you know what really pisses me off about people? Is if they have something like a like a mental disorder, like ADHD or, or OCD or some shit like that. I hate it when they make it their whole fucking personality. Like, they do something, you know, a little quirky or whatever. And they're like, oops, oops, there's my ADHD. Like, bro, shut the fuck <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Okay, that shit is so annoying. Oh, oh, look at me. I, I did something slightly less than normal. Oh, oh, there's my ADHD. Like, dog, no one fucking cares. Okay, no one, no one cares. And, and he's doing that throughout the entire video. Like, like that's dead ass his personality throughout the entire thing. Like, look at the fucking title. I didn't even realize that. Oh, oh, there, there's my ADHD. I didn't realize he put that shit in the title. Look, he's milking the shit out of this ADHD shit. Like, bro, <laughs> who's gonna tell him that is not the four letters he needs to be worried about? And this, and this shit is so disturbing because if you just watch this video with no prior knowledge, it just kind of looks like a brain rotted little man yelling about bird. Like, bro, I don't see how he's able to get in front of a camera and act like nothing fucking happened. It's crazy. Okay, okay. So I, I was looking at this and I thought that the people who were still watching his content were like his fans, but uh, no. Okay, <laughs> one, one peek at the comment section really just proves that wrong. They are all on this guy's shit. I mean, look at this. Crazy how blood is still posting like if nothing happened. That's what I'm saying. Like, why the fuck is he still doing this shit? I mean, first of all, why is he even allowed to do this shit? Like, bro, he should just be banned. But other than that, like, how does he still have hope in his career? But, I mean, because you know that's why he's doing it, right? Like, he he's only posting in an attempt to get back his viewership. I, it's kind of like the same thing with EDP and his website. But, like, bro, how are you not smart enough to know that that shit will never work? There's very little things that you can do that are just completely unfixable. And being a pedophile is one of them. Like, why are you still trying? <laughs> the, the comment section is fucking... They are tearing into this guy. Should have kept playing Gmod. Nah, bro, for real. Though. Maybe, maybe if you didn't drop all of your friends to start a dog shit ass solo channel, you wouldn't have groomed little girls. But I mean... Whatever, they are still playing Gmod, so clearly you're the more sophisticated one. How does bro still have a channel? That's that's what I'm saying, okay? Why why was EDP's channel deleted, but this fucking degenerate is still making money off this shit? Like, bro, make this man go out and get a 9 to 5. Get his channel the fuck out of here. Hey, man, <laughs> I hope you're miserable. Congrats on 4.6 million subs. Was here since 5 million. <laughs> oh, bro, like I said, I didn't watch him before all that shit went down, so I have literally no idea. But how many subs did this guy have before his pedo shit? Because I, I really want to know, how many fucking subscribers has he lost? I mean, whatever the number is, it it's still not enough. Bro does not deserve a channel at all, let alone one with 4.6 million subscribers. Like, 
I mean, that shit just needs to be gone, bro. Yeah, I'm going through his videos and he posts pretty regularly, like at least once a week. And all of them, you can just tell he's trying so hard to bring back his audience. I mean, seriously, bro is doing try not to laughs. Like, dog, that was like 2018. You're, you're pretty far behind, bud. Okay, get with it. He's still doing all the gaming shit. Like, he's really just doing everything that he did before to try his absolute best to get his people back. Bro, what? That is, first of all, that's so desperate. And second of all, it's not gonna fucking work. Okay, it just, it will literally never work. Nobody's gonna watch your fucking videos. Let the career go, bro. Okay, let it rest. Put it to bed. Okay, find something new. This shit is not gonna work, man. And and the comment section is gonna remind you of that every single week. I really, I, I don't even understand. I, I genuinely do not get how this guy can just like get on camera and still act like he did nothing. Everybody knows. And, and like he curated the whole video to not show what chat was saying, right? Which I guess makes sense because half of them were probably spamming like, oh, you're a pedo. How the fuck can you put up with that shit? Like, how... How are you going to be so desperate to have a career that you like sit and sit in a stream for four hours, people being like, hey, you're a fucking loser. You're a pedo. I mean, they're right, right? Like you, you can't be bad at them for spamming that shit. They are right. Why the fuck are you sitting through that? Go get a job, dude. Go try something new. You fucked up really, really bad. You're a terrible person. Quit with the, the internet shit. No, nobody's, you don't have fans anymore, dude. You don't. Why, why are you still looking for them? They're gone. They, they will never be there. This mini, this mini lad guy is fucking delusional. Like, I genuinely cannot understand why bro is still trying. I, I don't get it. In what world does he think that this shit would work? It hasn't worked with a single person ever. Even Call Me Carson, who honestly, I mean, bro, okay, listen, she was 17, he was 19. I don't know. Maybe I don't have all the information, but like, yeah, yeah, that's not good, but it's not half as bad as what Mini Lad did. And if Call Me Carson can't pull as many views as he did before, why the fuck does this Mini Lad guy think that he could he even have a sliver of hope? I, I, I don't get it. Mini Lad, get the fuck off the platform, dog. You're not wanted. Anyways, sub to the channel. Unless you're a fan of Minilad, then like, I don't know, <laughs> go get some help, you're pretty much fucked in the head.